price so let me just get like quite a number so my husband has gone to pick their ruby and they will come and meet me here just so that we meet up with their closing time so guys you can see the division of labor <laughs> in this country like Right hand jeans. I'm gonna need like two of this. Guys, yeah, it's not. Oops. Uh -huh. right what i'm looking for is right in front of me i want to ah and it's so far off what did we win beach chair and umbrella, <laughs> beach chair and umbrella. <laughs> getting back home so today I have brought to you another grocery haul I'm going to show you very quickly what we got from the African store from real canadian store and h and w fresh produce everything there has all we got today and i'll just be showing you really quickly with the prices because i recall that the last time i filmed a grocery haul a lot of people really wanted to know how much i spent in my grocery haul so today i'm going to give you the price of each item in each store and the total amount we spent today the last time i need to put i need to give some context to this the last time I had a grocery haul was in was in April, I think last week in April. Somebody should correct me if I, if I'm if I'm wrong. I'll have to go and check when it was and put it here. But I think it was in April. So since then I've not had this kind of grocery haul. Yes, we've had to buy stuff, perhaps even on a weekly basis, you know, bread, perishables, fruits, and all of those things. But like major haul, major haul. Since the last one I did, this is the next one. I hope that makes sense. Anyway, so let's get right into it. Here are my receipts. So this is for real Canadian store. This is how long it. This is how long the receipt is. This is for H and W. And the last one, this is for African store. So I bought four tubers of yam. There you have it. And this cost thirty-two dollars. So ice cream. Six dollars forty nine cents. I bought a crate of eggs. Sixteen dollars. This is 
is expensive. Pig milk, the family size, eighty dollars. African store. Bananas. You guys want to know the price? I will tell you. Banana is two dollar twenty nine cents. Okay. This pack of juice costs fifteen dollar ninety nine cents for the juice box. Next is paper towel, right? Let's see. What is here, guys? Fish, whitening fish, whitening fish. One pack costs twenty dollars. I bought two packs. Plantain chips cost three dollars each. I bought four, so this is twelve dollars. Peppers, peppers are usually five dollars. Let me put it in the freezer. I bought salt. I bought spinach and ugu. I bought puff puff mix. Beans flour. There's another bag here. Okay. So I bought biscuits for the kids. I'm sure I should be able to locate all these ones. So Cheetos, Cheetos cost $2.95. Goldfish cookies, yeah. And they cost $3.92 for both of them. Spring onion. And it cost $2. I bought two. I bought two. Two cost $2.98. Seedless grapes cost $3.95. Four. See, let's green. green pepper cost three dollar, three dollar, three dollar forty six. This for two it cost Doritos cost six dollar sixty six cents. This entire pack cost four dollar ninety nine. This sausage is sausage is eleven dollar ninety nine. Got two mandarins cost eight dollar. 80 cents okra i'm just trying this one out guys this okra so let's see i really like the fresh one sha but let me see how this one is this is my first time buying this cost two dollar ninety nine two dollar twenty nine two dollar twenty nine peas is one dollar twenty nine so this is the tomato paste i use now and it cost nine dollars so I bought it at two dollar twenty nine cents for each one. The four of them cost nine dollars sixteen cents. Sweet corn one dollar twenty nine. Just regular biscuits for the house three dollar sixty four cents. Sweet peppers and I bought two, two of them. I bought five dollars each. So I bought two ten dollars. I bought uh, potatoes. The potatoes cost five dollar ninety nine. The bag of onions cost. $10. This is not expensive. Laundry detergent. This one. Oh, it's heavy. I bought this one. Okay, this is the front. This one, Purex. And it cost. That detergent cost $14.99. Another bag here. Canola oil. $9.49. Vaseline. I got two. $4.79 each. Air freshener, I bought two sets. So this cost $16.99. I bought two, $33.98. The cake slices cost $5. Another bag here. It's Afri is, um, Canary African Day. It's Canada Day. It's Canada Day next tomorrow. So, I don't intend to go out or do any of those things. We'll just celebrate here at home. So I got pizza. And this cost $4.49. Try Ryan on this cereal. It says it doesn't want golden one anymore, guys. So I'm trying it on this one. Hopefully, hopefully it tastes like Cocoa Pops and he likes it. So next quick cost $5.47. This beef patty, like meat pie, we're just trying it out. This cost $11.99. That's a lot of money. Shrimps cost $15.58. Both of them each cost $7 plus. So this is about $15.58. Spaghettini, that's all we need. We don't need the fat also. Three, $3.19. And I bought rotini, just another type of pasta. Rotini and this rotini cost three dollars nineteen cents. Ambrosia apples. That's what my husband eats. This cost. Let me look at this. Cost 
14 dollars 20 cents this here costs about three dollars and some cents yeah i'm going to show you now the two things i cannot carry up so that's turkey and then the tomatoes 18 dollars and some cents so so here is the carton of turkey 50 dollars the box of tomatoes 18 dollars so now i'll show you everything we got from the three everything we got from the three stores today. This is a heap. So this will last more than a month, like well over a month. A lot of things here will last a long time. So for stew, I don't intend to go for tomatoes shopping and all of those things till winter, say say October. This is June. So July, August, September. Yeah, to like October. So a lot of things here will last. Things that might not stay so long will be pasta, the fruits of course. The children's uh, cereal, their snacks. Uh, what else might not stay so long? Their juice box, those kind of stuff. But every other thing would last a really long time. So how much did we did we spend? In real Canadian store, we spent three hundred dollars eighty one cents. Three hundred dollars eighty one cents in real Canadian store. At African store, we spent. Two hundred and fifty-one dollars ninety-seven cents. Two hundred and fifty-one dollars ninety-seven cents. And lastly, at H and W Produce, we spent twenty-one dollars ninety-eight cents. So five hundred and seventy-four dollars in total. Is it worth it? Yes. This is going to last a very long time. You are not going to watch me while I pack this up and try to arrange the kitchen. I have less than ten minutes to do that because. We're going in for a meeting ASAP. So watch me. Watch me. And then there's there's the free gift we got as well. This is an umbrella and a beach chair. Like this is just so beautiful. That's all. Meeting has started. Let me join my husband for the meeting. And then what else again? I need to come out and sort out the turkey and put it in different plates. In di different ziplock and freeze. And then get on with my day. So yeah, I'm really tired guys. This is past eight. I'll have a bath and I'll see you guys later. Okay, bye.